Summer is here. Congratulations to all of you out there that just survived another year of college or university, and even those of you in high school that just got accepted into college. Hey everyone, Eric here, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Now that you've had some time to relax after taking those grueling final exams, hopefully getting all of the grades that you wanted, it's time to talk some business. In this video, I'm here to help you save more money next semester. How do I do that? Well, by recommending the five best cashback credit cards for college students living that college lifestyle. I don't know about you, but when I was in college, the biggest spending categories on and off campus were probably a mixture between dining, grocery stores, and entertainment. So my goal for this video is to help show you which out of the hundreds of different types of credit cards out there help you put more money back into your pockets when you spend money. So with all the bases covered, let's talk about the first cashback credit card on that list. Up first, it's always the classic, one of the most recommended cashback credit cards out there for students, the Discover It Student Cashback Credit Card. There's a reason why this beauty constantly gets recommended to new college students year after year. This no annual fee cashback credit card earns you 5% cashback on everyday purchases at different places each quarter. Discover definitely keeps college students in mind when deciding what the rotating categories are because just look at this list. You have 5% back on grocery stores and fitness clubs and memberships for the months of January, February, and March. You have 5% back on gas stations and Target for the months of April, May, and June. You have 5% back at restaurants and PayPal for the months of July, August, and September. And finally, the potent 5% cash back on Amazon.com and digital wallets for the months of October, November, and December. That 5% cash back on digital wallets for three months is just simply insane. Considering the fact that this basically turns this card into a 5% cash back credit card for anything for three months. Plus, I haven't even mentioned the welcome bonus that this card provides as well. The welcome bonus is a 2x cash back match which means that for every five percent cash back category that you make a purchase on it matches that for the first year basically meaning discover will double it meaning those categories that i just mentioned 10 percent cash back that's literally unheard of and for the months of october through december that's 10 percent cash back for any purchase with the digital wallet making it the discover it student cash back credit card a 10 percent cash back card for three months so for purchases that you make on apple pay google pay or whatever form of pay that you have on your phone becomes 10% for three whole months. That is just ridiculous. Up next is the Capital One Saver One Cash Rewards Cashback Credit Card. Yeah, it's a mouthful to say but it definitely has the reward system to back it up. And recently, Capital One has actually revamped this card to, dare I say, the best student cashback credit card on the market ever. And after I'm done showcasing everything that this card provides for you, you'll probably also be thinking the same idea. This no annual fee cashback credit card earns you 3% cashback on dining, entertainment, popular streaming services, and grocery stores. Four different categories, all 3% cashback categories. Also included is 8% cashback on Capital One entertainment purchases, and tickets at Vivid Seats. Also, also just recently included is that Capital One is also including 5% cash back on hotels and car rentals when booking through Capital One's travel portal. Also, 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 they've just added that you can get $100 cash back when you spend $100 within the first three months of account opening with the Capital One Saver One Cash Reward credit card. With all that being said, this credit card definitely packs a punch. And here's actually the list of things that code for entertainment, meaning you'll get 3% cash back for any of these categories. And if you notice for purchases that do not count as entertainment, it lists collegiate sporting events, which is fine because number one, when you're in college, all of the college sporting events are free for you as a college student. And let's just say hypothetically that you want to see a college game after you graduated from college. Well, actually Capital One Entertainment and Vivid Seats have you covered for 8% cash back. Not only that, Capital One Entertainment and Vivid Seats also also provide tickets for professional sporting events, music, comedy shows, and anything else entertainment related. And here's the list for things that code for popular streaming services, meaning you'll get 3% cash back for any of those. First, before even signing up for these select streaming services, you definitely want to capitalize on the low monthly fees that these select streaming services promote to college students. And then once you're done with that, body slam them with the 3% cash back in popular streaming categories when you get this cash back credit card. Shout out to yet another major credit card issuer that does doesn't provide any help for us weebs out there. But anyways, back to this video, need I say more about the Capital One Saver One Cash Rewards credit card? No? You get it? Alright, let's move on. Next up is the Bank of America Cash Rewards credit card for students. 
It's a no annual fee credit card that gets you 3% cash back in a category of your choice. And then it's 2% cash back at grocery stores and wholesale clubs. And then it's 1% on any other eligible purchase. With the 3% cash back in one category of your choice, you get six options to choose from. I can definitely see three enticing categories amongst the six. If you live off campus and commute to class every single day, the 3% cash back category on gas is definitely the way to go. If you're someone who basically can't live without shopping online or amazon.com, I know that I definitely the 3% cash back on online shopping is pretty nuts. If you're somewhat of a foodie and just frequently visits that one street close to campus that is just filled with different types of restaurants, maybe the 3% cash back category on dining is enticing for you. I personally don't really see a lot of college students doing much of traveling or drugstore purchases or home improvement and furnishing. And then on top of that, you get 2% on grocery stores and wholesale clubs. So if you find someone out there who has their parents, Costco or Sam's Club membership handy all the time, maybe Maybe consider being their best friend because then you'll get to go with them when they ever, whenever they go to Costco or Sam's Club. With this card, you also earn $200 cash back rewards bonus after spending at least $1,000 within the first three months of account opening. I can understand why this task is a bit expensive, especially to college students, but consider maybe fronting for some people and then having them Venmo or Cash App you back. Then you can hit that $1,000 spending incentive without actually spending $1,000 of your own money. The fourth card on this list is a Chase Freedom Student Credit Card. Definitely one of the lacking student credit cards on this list, but when you get the chance to evolve this credit card, it's definitely a keeper card. This no annual fee cashback credit card will earn you 1% cashback on all purchases. Yep, that's all it does. If I really had to equate this to a Pokemon, I'd equate the Chase Freedom Student Credit Card to a Magic Card, and then the Evolution version to something like a Gyarados. Because the evolution of this card is definitely something like a Gyarados. You also get a $50 cashback bonus that can be earned by making any purchase with this card within the first three months of account opening. Plus, you'll earn an extra $20 after each account anniversary. But you'll definitely want to apply for the Chase Freedom Flex, the Evolution version, or the Gyarados in this case, after you're allowed to do so in 12 months. If you want more information about the Chase Freedom Flex, I actually made a short video about the Chase Freedom Flex and you can learn everything about it in 60 seconds or less. I'll put a little link right here and also in the descriptions down below. All right, and finally, to wrap up this video, last but not least, I know this card isn't a student credit card. It's the City Custom Cash. But if you get the opportunity to secure this card, well, it's definitely a keep your card for all college students out there. There's no annual fee cashback credit card earns you 5% cashback in your top bending category for up to $500 every month. After that, it's 1% cashback on all purchases. And the reason why this card is on this list, even though it doesn't have all of the cashback that all the other credit cards out there have in this list, is that it saves you the hassle of having to remember what each credit card gives you back in cash back. Because I don't know about you, but the last thing I needed to do in college was to add something else to my my already overcrowded play that was college life. Because with this card, City personally calculates your top spending category for you. So all you have to do actually is to just remember what that credit card is for. You can make it exclusively a dining cashback credit card or a gas station cashback credit card or a grocery store cashback credit card. That's all you have to do. With that unique cashback strategy, you also earn $200 when you spend $750 within the first three months of account opening. Because let's face it, who doesn't love free money? All right, that just about wraps up this video. If you're someone out there who's a college student and have learned something new from this video, please leave the graduation cap emoji in the comments down below. And actually, for those of you out there who have just graduated from college or have graduated from college in recent years, let me know which cashback credit card that you went with when you were in college. And with that, thank you for watching. Stay safe out there, everyone. Peace.